Hi, today I will show you how to charge your laptop with a power bank. So what do you need, how you can do it, and what should you know? Let's start with the power bank. You need a power bank with a USB-C power delivery output, but that's not all. Not all USB-C power delivery outputs are the same. Check what's the maximum voltage that your USB-C can output, because sometimes it can be only 15 volts or 12 volts. And sometimes it will be enough. Your laptop will slowly charge, but it will charge. But sometimes your laptop may not charge at all. It will need 20 volts. So it is better to buy a power bank with 20 volts USB-C power delivery output because it is safer that it will work for sure with your laptop. And the another thing is that what is the maximum output power of the power bank? This one right here has a 65 watts output, but there are also 45 watts, the 100 watts, and many other powers. And the bigger power, the faster your laptop will charge, but uh, only to the limit that your uh, laptop can accept. So I would recommend minimum of 45 watts. Lower power will also work, but will charge your laptop really slowly or it cannot keep up with charging so the laptop will discharge slower but uh, from 45 watts up it should be good enough for many situations to charge up your laptop and if you have your power bank with the correct USB-C power delivery port the next step depends on your laptop the first situation is that you have a laptop with a USB-C port and usually this port is a multi-purpose port, so it can be used as a USB-C for data transfer and also for the USB-C power they very charging. If you have a laptop like this, this is simple. You take a USB-C to C cable, plug one end to the power bank, second end to the laptop, and it is charging. But I recommend to use a cable with the power display. Because sometimes, like in my situation, when I connect the power bank to my laptop with the USB cable, if the laptop is turned off, it won't start charging. I have to turn it on, it starts to charge, and I can turn it off. And with the power display, I can see if the laptop is right now charging or not. So, this is a really small but useful thing that you can be sure that your device is charging and also you can see when it stops charging because the power is low. It may be 0 watts or 1, 2 watts, so you can see that the device is fully charged. So this is the first option, but what if your laptop doesn't have a USB-C port? So for example, I have this Lenovo laptop. This has this traditional Lenovo rectangle port. So can I charge it with my power bank? Yes, I can but it needs an additional step. There are two options. First one is to buy an adapter like this. So this has this Lenovo output or any other brand, uh, any other plug that your laptop needs. And on the other end, this has a female USB-C port. And this thing has two purposes. First thing is that you can connect the USB-C cable and have the correct output. But also this triggers the power bank to output 20 volts because the uh, Lenovo charger, the default one that was with my laptop outputs 20 volts and this thing it talks to the power bank and tells it to output 20 volts because uh, you want the correct uh, voltage in this situation. So this is the one option and the second option is that you can buy a full cable few meters long with one end the laptop plug and other and mail USB-C port. So you can just bring one cable with your USB-C to laptop, or you can have only the adapter and with it use a USB-C to USB-C port. And in this situation, you can also use the cable with power display to connect it to the adapter and you can see how fast your device is charging. And with this simple knowledge, you can charge almost any laptop from the power bank it will give you probably like additional one battery longer life of the laptop, but it depends on the how big your laptop battery is. Sometimes it can be 
your two additional charges, sometimes can be one charge, sometimes half a charge, but it will give you more time to work when you need it. So that's all for today. Like, subscribe, and be nice.